Our next book is Patterntastic Treasure Hunt. On this, in this book, we have lots and lots of patterns. In here, you can see we have leopard print, we have stripes, we have dashes and swirls, we have squiggles, we have plain things. Do you see some interesting things on the cover already? I see a leopard and a kitty. I see some eggs. Should we open the book and see what we can find in here? Look at all of this in here. Can you name all of these spotty things? Which thing is the odd one out? What do you spy with your little eye? What do you guys see? Down here at the bottom, we have a list of some things. So I'm going to call some of those things out and you tell me what you see. So on this page, I see a spotty leopard. Do you see the spotty leopard? Yeah, where's the spotty leopard? I think the spotty leopard might be right here. Look at him right there. Do you see some spotty flowers? Look at that right here. Look at this. See, spotty flowers. What's next on our list? I think we have some spotty dogs. Do you guys see the spotty dogs? I think the spotty dogs, where are they? Are these the spotty dogs? No, they're not. Here's the spotty dogs. Look, one and two. What's next? Next, we need to see some spotty birds. Do you guys see any birds? Look at here. One, two, three, and four. Spotty birds. Those look like guinea hens. Can you say guinea hen? The next one we're looking for are spotty turtles. Do you see the spotty turtles? The spotty turtles are orange and black. Here they are, right there. Spotty toadstools. Do you know what a toadstool is? A toadstool is like a mushroom. So the spotty toadstool, they're here by the dogs. Do you see those? Toadstools. Next we have stripy frogs. Where are the frogs? I don't even know if Aunt Tracy sees the stripy frogs. Can you guys see the stripy frog? Is there only one? Where's that frog? He's so hard to see. <gasps> there he is! Look at his little face. Can you make a sound like a frog? Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Now next are the spotty salamanders. Do you know what a salamander is? Salamander is a creature that can live on land and it can also go swimming in the water. Look at, they're all in a row right here. One, two, three, four, five, six salamanders. And then we have some spotty eggs right there. Spotty eggs, we just had Easter. We had lots of eggs, huh? And then some spotty ladybugs. Where are they? They're right by the leopard. Do you see all these ladybugs up here? There they are. So this was our spotty, spotty, spotty page. Look at all of those creatures. Lots of things in nature have spots. Next time you go outside, you should look for some spots. What page do you think this is? What's the pattern on this page? What do you think? Can you name all of these stripy things? Which thing is the odd thing out? I see something with spots that is the odd thing out. Where's the thing with spots? Do you see th anything with spots instead of stripes? Yeah, there it is. It's the fish. So here on this page we have what? Can you spy with your little eye the tiger? Yeah, here's the tiger. What about the lemurs? Do you see the lemurs? Up here, there's a whole family. 
And what about zebras? Is there a mama zebra and a baby zebra? And caterpillars? And I see some sneaky snakes. Here they are. And there's something that makes honey. What makes honey? Do you know what makes honey? Bees make honey. Here's a whole bunch of bees up here. And there's something that starts out as a caterpillar and then becomes a butterfly. That's right. And then we have some gooseberries. Here are the berries. See all those? Green gooseberries. And I think the last thing are stripy plants. Do you see those? Have you ever seen stripy plants? So this is our stripy page. Have you seen anything in nature that's stripy? Have you been to the zoo and seen a zebra or a tiger? Oh, what's this page? Can you name all of the things that are spiky? Look at all the spiky things. What do you see? What is on this page? There's something here on this page that is not spiky. What do you think it is? I think it's that shell. I think this shell is smooth. Have you ever felt a shell? Shells are smooth. So who likes pineapple? I love pineapple. Pineapple is delicious and it smells wonderful. So we have some spiky pineapples. Next time you get a pineapple, a big pineapple, you touch the outside, it's really spiky. And we have some spiky icicles, which we see in the winter time. That's made out of water that freezes after it, and then, but it, when it's melting, it makes this long piece of ice and, and then it freezes while it's making that long piece of ice. And you can usually see those coming down off of a roof and then spiky cactuses. I'll bet that our little cousin Oscar has seen some spiky cactuses where he lives. And spiky sea urchins. Where are the sea urchins? Do you know what those are? Here they are, they're little animals and they're little spikes. They kind of wave like this in the ocean. They're from the ocean and spiky lychees. This is what a lychee looks like inside. That's the seed. And then the white flesh, that's what you eat. And it's a fruit. Um, let's see. And spiky fossil. Let's see. Spiky fossil. I guess that wasn't a shell. I guess that's supposed to be a fossil. So maybe it has a rough edge. So, and then let's see what else we have. Spiky holly leaves. See, if you've ever touched a holly leaf, these are actually quite sharp along the edge. And a spiky lionfish. Look at this lionfish. They have spikes right there, right? and spiky echidnas are these little animals right there they have little spikes right there like that so this is our spiky page so that's a fun little page and what's our next one gonna be this is a page full of spirals my goodness, look at all the spirals. Have you seen spiral things? What do you spy with your little eye on this page? I see some snails and spiral sunflowers. What else? What else do you see? Here's some seashells. See how it makes a circle that goes around and around? Yeah. And let's see, what about spiral sheep horns? See how it goes around in that shape like that? 
Can you make that shape with your finger? Take your finger and make it go around and around. See? Around and then get smaller and smaller and smaller. Right? And then pine cones, they go in a bit of a spiral like that too. Right? And then this fern, see how it goes? See, it gets tiny and then bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger till it goes down the full plant. So that's a spiral fern, right? And then look at they took all these tiny little pebbles and they made a spiral with all of those tiny little pebbles. So next time you go outside, look for some little pebbles or some little rocks and make a spiral. So it starts very small in the middle and then you make it bigger and bigger and bigger until you make a bigger spiral. So maybe you can ask your mom or your dad or a brother or a sister to help you make a spiral with some stones. See that? Spirals, right? But what thing is not like anything else? I think it's the spiky flower. The spiky flower belongs on our other page, doesn't it? So let's see what's next. <gasps> Look at this is the speckled page. All the speckled things. What do you see here on this page? I see lots of fun things. Can you name a few things that you see? What do you see? Do you spy with your little eye? Quack, 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 quack. What makes that sound? Does a duck make that sound? I believe it does. I spy with my little eye. Meow. Meow. Two kitties. They're speckled kitties. Do you see their fur? Speckled means that it has modeling, which means there's some, it's kind of spotty but it's a funny pattern. So it's not like a perfect circle, like a spot, but it's speckled. I spy with my little eye a speckled or, 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 something that you see in the ocean that makes that sound. Can you make that sound? Or, 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 or. It loves to go swimming and it loves to eat fish. Is that a speckled seal? Look at that. He loves to go swimming. What else do we see? <gasps> I spy with my little eye something that goes squeak, 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 squeak. And they like to eat some cheese. Is that a little speckled mouse? Sure is. And while we're looking at the mouse, what are these? Are those speckled stones? See, there's the kitties. And the seal. And what is that? Those are speckled stones. And then up here, what do you see there? Four speckled turtles. What do turtles like to do? Do they like to swim? They do. And then what is this? That's a speckled hawk. And then here, do we know what those are called? Those are speckled mushrooms. And the one thing that's not speckled, look at that. It's a wavy fern. See that plant? It's just a wavy fern. All right, so we're done with our speckled page and our very last page of all. Oh, no, we have two more pages. Our next page is the wavy page. Look at everything is wavy. So what do you see? What do you spy with your little eye that's wavy? Do you see some wavy goldfish? Goldfish kind of go shh, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh when they swim in the water, don't they? This is wavy. Can you do wavy with your hand? 
where it just goes back and forth, just waves. So things can wave in the water and things can wave in the wind. Can you make wind by blowing air out of your mouth? So wavy with your hand. So what do you see? Wavy goldfish and wavy snakes. See how they're wavy like that? Can you do that? And wavy plants. See, like one we saw on the other on the other page. And wavy bird tails, look at this. See how their tails go? See how they just wave? So gentle. Wavy. And wavy seaweed. Here's some seaweed. Aunt Tracy's eaten seaweed before. Have you eaten seaweed? If you've ever had sushi, you've had seaweed. See, there's the seaweed. What else is wavy? Are kitty cat tails wavy? Yeah, sometimes kitty cat tails do this, don't they? Wavy kitty cat tails. And wavy ears of barley. Barley is a grain that you can eat. We don't really eat very much of it, but it's something that you can eat. And wavy horse's tail. Have you ever seen horses? We see horses at Grandma Dee Dee's, don't we? In the field by her house. And then look. Do you know what those are? Those are called eels. And you see those in the ocean. Aunt Tracy has swum with eels before and fed them by hand. I have fed eels by hand when I swam in the water. And what on this page is not wavy? It's in the very, very middle. It's just a mottled peach. See that? It's mottled, not wavy. And on our very last page, there are so many things you've seen in this book of nature's pattern. Can you name the thing you haven't seen before? What's the thing that we didn't see before? I see it. I spy with my little eye the thing we did not see. So, it's kind of red. Do you see what we did not see before? It's red and it has five points and it comes from the ocean. Is it the tiger? Does the tiger come from the ocean? It's not the tiger. It's not the big horned sheep. It's not the snails, it's not the salamanders, it's not the wavy snake or the wavy goldfish or the mottled kitty or the spotted egg. It's not the spiral fern or the spiky holly. It's not the seal. It's not the mottled turtle or the speckled rocks. I don't believe that we saw the starfish before. Did we? The five-pointed starfish. I'll bet you saw that that's what it was. Well, that was really fun looking at the pattern book with you. The end. Pattern-tastic treasure hunt. Next time you go outside, I want you guys to see what kind of patterns and what kind of things you see in nature. I love you.